In this session, we're going to look at the Joomla workflow. Now, I want to repeat a little bit from session number five, just to make sure that we're on the right track. And then after this brief introductory video, we'll go through how to create sections and categories for your Joomla site. Joomla breaks your content down into three types of articles. One is a section. Now, sections are broad categories, broad ideas of content. If we were building a website about the movies, our sections might be movie information, movie gossip, movie stars. Under each one of those, then, would be categories. Categories are the more narrowly defined articles of information. So under our movie information section, we might have romantic comedy, drama, and action as categories. Then under those categories, we'd have articles that would fit into each one. So under romantic comedy, you might have romancing the stone if you're old like me, or if you're young like my daughter, Hitch. Under action movies, you might have a good Arnold, you know, I'm here to pump you up kind of movie. And you know, that would be a good place to put those. Unless of course it's Kindergarten Cop, which we're not really sure why Arnold made that movie. The last kind of article you can have is uncategorized. Now an uncategorized article is one that just doesn't fit into a category. The trick there is you have to have the fourth part of the Joomla workflow in order to get to that article, and that's menu. Sections, category, article, menus. Now I know in our course we went through menus first, and that's because it appears first in the menu structure. But in reality, it's the last part of the Joomla workflow. So, sections, categories, articles, menus. That's the Joomla workflow.